People just love the thrill of sitting in the stands and cheering on their favorite athletes. In North America alone, more than 277 million spectators pack into the major sports stadiums in an average year. And why not? This is as close as you can get to the action without being on the field. Today, it's the promise of action that brings 3,500 spectators to Navarra, Spain's Tafola Arena. They're here to witness a death-defying event. In Spanish, it is called recortes, which loosely translates to bull dodging. In a tradition that dates back to the Bronze Age, recortadores test their skill, leaping out of the way of a thundering 1,100-pound bull. It's a deadly game. Fighting bulls are selectively bred to ensure that each animal possesses enhanced aggression, strength, and stamina. And when charging, they can hit a top speed of 40 miles per hour, over four times faster than most men can run. If you're watching this battle from the stands, you're probably feeling some measure of comfort, knowing there's a protective barrier between you and the ring. But there's something else you should know. Bulls can jump. It's a nightmare scenario. Without warning, the raging beast leaps the wall and launches itself into the grandstands. For the people in the front row, it's like being hit by an 1,100-pound battering ram. Others scramble for safety, but can't get out of the way from the bull's horns fast enough. Panicked and cornered, the bull grows more aggressive by the second. Bad news for the hundreds of spectators still in its crosshairs. Now, put yourself in their place. Would you know how to escape the bullseye? What would you do? A, avoid the bull's head and move to its flanks. B, back away and wave a light-colored cloth. Or C, run down the bleachers.